Hello World Lock Picking Dev. Today I have a Vero padlock and we are at Reflex Reflection Lake in Mount Rainier National Park. <clears throat> this is five pins. Uh, I don't believe any security pins. So uh, let's take a pick in and uh, see what we can feel. A little click out of one there. Or click out of two, click out of one. Four. And there's our open. So yeah, no security pins inside this. And let's show you our bidding. A little Vero padlock here. Yeah, five pins. And behind us here, we are at Reflection Lake in Mount Rainier National Park. And you can see why it's called Reflection Lake here. Absolutely gorgeous. It doesn't look like the lock can be gutted at all, so we can't take it apart and see its side. Um, there's a little weird pin there. I'll show you when I get home. But uh, there's no security pins in this, so that's it for this Vero padlock. All right, this is Reflection Lake at Mount Rainier National Park. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. All right, we're back home. And yeah, let me show you that pin I was talking about real quick. I haven't really seen one of these yet. So at the top here, you normally see that you get the... Uh, you know, a bolt or something that you can unscrew right there. This one's just a flat pin right there. And on the other side here, you don't really see a any indication of something that you can knock out. So usually on sometimes of these kind of locks right here on the sides where the uh, Bible is, where the pins are, sometimes you can see where the pin chambers are and you can hit them and you can, uh, you know, gut the lock that way and drill it out. I don't see any indication on it right here, so I'm thinking that that pin is a way to hold something in place when they're putting putting it together. Yeah, I'm just not quite sure how, and it's probably one of those hidden little pins that are machined into the body here somewhere. Anyways, this is a FA, FAI by Vero, and that was Reflection Lake. Alright everyone, thanks for watching.